みなさん、こんにちは。僕はニクです。これは日本語のストリームです。頑張ります。Now,、uh, welcome in, guys. It's another Japanese stream today. Let's do more of it. Now,、uh, we are moving. We're on a new week here. If you don't know the channel, it's called The Voice of Nick. I play video games live three times a day and seven days a week. It's all story focused games on here, and I don't talk over the story or cutscene moments. But this is not a story based game, but rather our story of learning Japanese together. So, saddle up, get ready to、uh, learn together. This is day 121、uh, on our Duolingo journey here. Let's do it. Now, if you、uh, want to see which games are being played, you can type exclamation mark games in the chat. You'll get a full list of all seven concurrent gameplay series going right now. And if you like what you see today, don't forget to hit that follow button. Up top, you see a follower goal of nine. We're currently at six, so we're getting there, guys. The 28th entry in the Twitch playbook is out now. It is called Make Your Streams More Watchable, and that's going to help you to increase visibility and understanding on your streams for people who, no matter what platform they're watching on. Now, obviously, that's really important. If you don't know the Twitch playbook, it is a free podcast that I created to help all of you guys in this community either create your own Twitch channels from scratch or improve on an existing channel if you already have one. Every episode is 10 minutes or less, so it's very bite sized, and it's been coming out for the last 28 weeks in a row, so there's plenty of it. You can find it on iTunes, on Spotify, on all the major podcast platforms by searching the Twitch Playbook, or you can type exclamation mark playbook into the chat. You'll get a link directly to it. Welcome, everybody, into the show. Decap resubscribing for the 11th month. Thank you so much to Decap, and welcome in. Let's get a konbanwa to Decap, and let's get some hype in that chat. One month from the new badge. That is true. Thank you so much, Decap, for that continued support. And let's get one of these on here. Uh, Decap, as a member of the Coffee Posse, nay, the Latte Club at Tier 2, you have many things on here, including the Voice of Nick emotes, legendary status in the chat and Discord, 200 meatballs, higher chance to win in the heist minigames and ad free streams. You also have the handsome sub badge in front of your name, which, as, as you pointed out, will actually be upgrading in just one month's time.、Uh, thank you so much to Decap、uh, for the continued support,、It、is very highly appreciated. And、uh, let's learn some Japanese, ladies and gents. Decaf, are you ready to learn some Japanese? Here we go. Now, we are on home still, so let's do home. Let's do it. It is a house. Ie des. Ie des. Mado wa soko des. Mado wa soko des. There's a yard. Uh, Niwa ga arimas. Niwa ga arimas. Ie wa koko des. Ie wa koko des. The window is there. Mado wa soko des. Mado wa soko des. Ie wa doko des ka? 家はどこですか？ディガセン、私は日本語を something する something else ができています。うん、not really sure what that one would be. As for me, Japanese language something something. Something exists. Yeah, all of the kanji in there I didn't recognize. One of them has a piece for tsunami, but that's not really going to represent what it means. Let's take a look. Ready to study. Good stuff. Oh, that's benkyo. Good stuff. Benkyo suru. I don't know the kanji for benkyo yet. Jumbi. Oh, nice. Jumbi is ready. Okay, I know the words then, so that's good, but it's just that we don't.、Uh, Have the kanji for them yet. The house is over here. Ie wa kochira des or koko des? They're probably just doing koko, yeah. Ie wa wa koko des. That's so tricky. Toire wa asoko des. Toire wa asoko des. The bathroom is over there. Koko wa doko des ka? ここはどこですかそこにあります。そこにあります。Uh, 
it's basically saying like, there it is. Oh yeah, yeah, there it is. Where's the yard? Niwa, wa, doko desu ka? Niwa wa, mado. Oops, doko. Doko desu ka? Mado wa doko desu ka? Mado wa doko desu ka? Um. Asoko wa doko desu ka? Or soko would work as well. Soko. Uh, where is that place? Soko Niwa. It wouldn't be that kind of wa, though. Mm. This isn't really a complete sentence, though. Doko desu ka? That's stupid. That's not saying, that's basically saying, like, where, question mark. But that's, not, the implication is you're trying to say, where is that place? Like, the way that they, that was stupid. Koko wa doko desu ka? Koko wa doko desu ka? Where is here? Where am I? It is over there. Asoko desu. Asoko. Ni arimasu works as well. Ari masu. Niwa ga asoko desu. Niwa ga asoko desu. Uh, the yard is over there. Niwa ga asoko desu. Niwa wa asoko. Asoko desu. Um. Asoko wa doko desu ka? Oh, this is where they're just saying doko desu ka. Where's doko? Doko desu ka. That's a stupid one. Decaf is watching the Barbie nightmare party. Good stuff. That was a good time, the Barbie nightmare party. So these are going to be the ones that we recently learned, which we're very unlikely to get correct. Most of these were, they're going to be very hard fought victories. First, you pass by a big hospital. Hazume ni ooki na byouin no soba o torimasu. I think that's right. Hazume ni ooki na byouin no soba o I believe it is Torimas. This refrigerator is old. Kono Rezoko wa furui desu. Kono Rezoko wa furui desu. Eki kara hotel made kuruma de go fun kurai kakarimas. Eki kara hotel made kuruma de go fun kurai kakarimas. Takes about gofun five minutes to get by car from station to hotel. Eki kara. Eki. Kara. Kara. Hotel. Hotel. Made. Made. Kuruma de. Kuruma de. Gofun. Gofun. Kurai. Kurai. Kakarimasu. Hakimasu. It is an old television. Furu. Would you say furu na? I guess it would be furui terebi desu. Furui terebi desu. Byouin wa konbini no minami ni arimasu. Byouin wa konbini no minami ni arimasu. Hospital is to the minami south of the convenience store. Byouin wa. Byouin. Konbini no Konbini no Minami ni Minami ni Arimasu Higashi but Arimasu This path goes southwest Kono michi wa Southwest Oh Uh Nansei Eh Ikimasu 
I think that might be right. Kono Michi wa. Michi. Wa. Nansei would be. Di, di, di. Nansei. Yeah. Ni. Ikimasu. Raigetsu wa. Damn. Doko ni ikimasho ka? Raigetsu wa. Doko ni ikimasho ka? Uh. Doko. Where should I go next month? Raigetsu. Raigetsu wa. Doko ni. Doko ni. Ikimasho ka? Iki. Got him. I enter the office. Um, I enter the office. Is uh, Kaisa uh, O Irimas? Or no, no, uh, it would be a Hai Hai Irimas? I don't know how you pronounce it. Iri. No, they're saying the other version, but that's not how you pronounce it. Kaisha ni haidimasu. I think it's haidimasu. Hold on. We're going to look this up. Welcome, Alexandru the God, into the street. Let's get an exclamation mark konbanwa to Alexandru. Do I live in Japan? No, I live in uh, in California, but um, I'm learning Japanese. Today is day 121 in a row of Duolingo. Welcome into the stream. Can we get a konbanwa for Alexandru the God joining the show? Uh, we have... Do, 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 uh, Kaisha. Why doesn't that work? Kaisha. Ni. Hairimasu. I knew it. They pronounced it as the Onyomi reading. Kaisha ni hairimasu. Good stuff. Am I planning to travel there? Um, I've traveled there twice already, and I, that was why I originally started learning. That was two years ago. Um, but it's always good to know a language. Always good. How about you? Are you planning a trip to, uh, to, to Japan? This path goes to the southwest. Alexandria is doing Chinese, but you're not uh, planning any Japanese trips. I've actually been to China uh, once. I did uh, Shanghai for one day. All right, I think it was like a day and a half. I was in Shanghai for a day and a half. The first time I went to Asia because I went, wanted to go to, to Shanghai Disney, which had just been opened that year. Um, so that was really, really fun. China seemed amazing, but uh, I didn't get it, you know, nearly enough time to actually like, you know, explore it. Oh, you are planning to go to China. Nice. Awesome. Well, then maybe you could spend one day in Japan as with China being the main part of your trip. Then <laughs> we'll have like uh, mirrored trips. Good stuff. Good stuff. That makes sense then if you're learning Chinese and you're and you're going over uh, to China. When is your uh, when is your planned trip? This TV is old. Kono terebi wa furui desu. Kono terebi wa furui desu. Hon ga hon dana ni ichi satsu arimasu. Hon ga hon dana ni ichi satsu arimasu. There is this is a weird way of saying this. I think what you, they're trying to say is there's one book on the bookshelf. Do they say hon ga or hon wa? They said hon ga. Hon ga hon dana ni ichi sap arimasu. There's one book on the bookshelf. Hon ga hon dana ni ichi satsu arimasu. Interesting. Do you guys think, was there actually an M&M's video game, or is that a crazy dream? Um, was there an M&M's video game? I, I would say it's not, I wouldn't rule it out. There was a Sour Patch Kids video game, and I think Method Man was in it. That was a weird situation. That was actually a pretty cool game, though. It was like a little platformer. Um, Alexandra saying, I want to be moderately conversational before you go, probably in a year's time. Good stuff. That's good stuff. Yeah, if you set like a, try and figure out like the date or whatever, 
and then like have that date and then you can sort of like build up to it you know uh that's really good but yeah i uh that's what i wanted to do when i first learned japanese so that this what we call it here is like i refer to it as like brushing up on japanese but i was never necessarily conversational i was uh i knew enough of it i never got as far as i did here on duolingo for example but i knew enough of it at the time to like read signs like you know read the parts that i needed to read on the signs at least and also not get kicked out of the bars the really small tokyo bars that they don't want you to speak anything but japanese in uh so that was enough for me like it was definitely the first time i was there a lot of bars would kick you out because they'd be like no you know japanese only or whatever and i thought they were saying you if you look like you're not japanese you can't be here but what they were saying was if you are not speaking japanese you can't be here <laughs> which uh uh, so then I once I realized that I was like, oh, okay, I'll learn Japanese the next time I go and I did and then I didn't get kicked out So that was fun. <laughs> that was fun Yeah, it definitely opens a lot of doors to be able to at least speak the language on some level But you'll actually you'll learn a lot as you're there, too That's pretty the pretty cool part as long as you can work up the courage to speak it. That's the thing is like wherever you you live um, try and go to places where they speak Chinese and actually have a conversation with a person like in Chinese because that's what I do for Japanese and it's insanely difficult to do uh, the way I describe it to everybody I'll go on the full screen the way I describe it to people who are a lot of people have been watching these streams and learning along with Japanese with me but it applies to any language whatever you know right now take whatever you know if you're attempting to have a conversation you instantly lose 60% of whatever you think you know and you're only working with the remaining 40%. So you really, there's gonna be a lot of words that you think you know right now, but when you have to come up with it on the spot, you're not gonna know it. So like, just make sure that you have the basic ones and you'll be fine. DGAP's saying, um, when I was a kid, Eminem's game was like the Eminem's minis took over a factory. I don't remember. What platform was it on? Maybe Game Boy? I would guess it would be on Game Boy. First you pass by a big hospital. How's your many? おきな病院のそばを通ります。初めに初めに大きな病院のそばそばを通ります。ます。お、I Alexander, saying there's two local stores near me that are owned by Chinese people. Yeah, so definitely like, um, you know, if you can find an excuse to speak in Chinese, or if you're at a restaurant, that's a good place to do it because like they kind of have to talk to you. So at a restaurant, I I usually try to say like, uh, I ask them just in English, do you understand Japanese? Because I don't, I used to just say like, Nihongo ga hansimasu ka, but then like, it, it was kind of like presumptuous. So I would just say, like, do you understand Japanese? And then if they said yes, I would say, like, Nihongo de onegaishimasu, like, basically saying, like, can, can I speak in Japanese, please? And then they'd be like, oh, yeah. And then they would do, like, you know, have, like, a conversation with me in Japanese, which is definitely what you want to try and do. Uh, because, yeah, like, it, it's totally different once you're trying to talk versus trying to read or write or speak just to your computer. I buy one book. There's one book on the bookshelf. This building is in a building. This building, as for this building, it's at an intersection? I might have missed a word, hold on. No, they're saying this building is, as, is at an intersection. この建物は交差点にあります。来月はどこに行きましょうか? 
Um, so next month, where shall I go? Wait. Oh, they probably didn't let me say go in. They probably wanted me to say enter. That's the same thing. Yeah. Sometimes Duolingo is just arbitrary. All, all apps are like this because they could never predict every possible correct answer. But yeah, I go in the office is the same thing as I enter the office. Eki kara ho no. Uh, I go to it takes about 10 minutes to get from the train station to the school. この建物は交差点にあります。Watch ready. Instead of saying I go in the office, I'm going to say I enter the office. I'll make this in caps. This is the only thing I changed and it's correct. So they just don't like the word go in. Yeah, it's important to realize that Duolingo is not all knowing. Like a lot of times it's just uh, limited in a certain way and you just have to, you know, sort of like live with that, I guess. Let's do some home stuff here. Re, de, te, te fu, inu, inu, petto. petto. Neko desu. Neko, tori Oops. desu. Inu desu. It's a dog. Inu desu. Neko ga arimasu. I think this was neko. Neko. Oh, imas. I'm going to mark that as wrong because I keep doing that. What are these kanji here? This one is rice paddy. This one is flowers. I don't know what that one is. Neko desu. Neko desu. There are two birds. Um, tori ga niwa imasu. I think this is bird. Tori. Yeah. Ga ni wa there are seven birds. Do you guys think it was a PC game? So, hmm. When do you think it was uh, was from the M and M's game? There are dogs and cats. Uh, inu to neko ga imasu. Inu to, to neko, neko ga, ga imasu. imasu. Tori ga niwa imasu. Tori ga niwa imasu. There are two birds. Inu desu. Inu desu. Inu ga imasu. Inu ga imasu. Tori ga ichi wa imasu. I'm not sure how you pronounce that. Sometimes the one or two uh, for a certain type of counter will have a a different pronunciation. Tori ga ichi wa imasu. I'm actually going to translate this because I'm curious. The bird is at a loss. Uh, maybe this is the counter for a bird talks. No, I don't know what the counter for birds is though. There is a bird. Oh, there you go. Tori ga ippa imas. Tori ga ichiwa imas. And now they pronounce it as ichiwa. Well, what? I don't know what to believe. Inu to neko ga imasu. Inu to neko ga imasu. There is a uh, dog and cat. Inu ga imasu. Inu ga 
います。猫がいます。猫がいます。There are seven birds. 鳥が七羽います。鳥が七。Oh, yeah, that's the counter right there. Hane, i, mas. Interesting. Tori ga ichu a imas. Tori ga ichu a imas. Neko ga imas. Neko ga imas. Good stuff. Let's keep going with it. How many tables are in the room? Here, the table ga itsu arimas. Here, the table ga table wa itsu. Oh, itsu is five things. Iksu is how many? Iksu arimas. We're going to mark that as wrong. Hey, any table wa iksu a r i m a s k a Oh, I didn't say ka either, so it would have been wrong either way. Hey, any table wa iksu a r i m a s k a Well, there you go. How many tables in the room? There is one chair. Um, isu ga hitotsu a r i m a s Isu. There are three windows in the room. Here, the window is. I think it's three windows. Here, the window is. Three. Oh, they wanted us to say ga, but I think it would still be correct. I think we would have still been right. Yeah, because it would say, as for the windows in the room, there are three of them. That would be correct. It is a desk. Tsukue desu. Tsukue desu. Isu ga futatsu a r i m a s There are two desks. Tsukue ga futatsu a r i m a s Tsukue ga futatsu a r i m a s Tsukue ga futatsu a r i m a s Tsukue ga futatsu a r i m a s There's one table. Table ga futatsu a r i m a s テーブルが一つあります。机です。机です。There are three tables. テーブルが三つあります。テーブルが三つあります。部屋に椅子はいくつありますか？部屋に椅子はいくつありますか？ In the room, how many chairs are there? There is one desk. Tsukue ga hitotsu arimas. Tsukue ga hitotsu arimas. Futatsu arimas ka? Futatsu arimas ka? Unseen420, thank you for the lurk. Let's get some hearts in that chat. Oops. For Unseen, thank you, Unseen, for the lurk. And welcome to the stream. There are three chairs in the room. Hea ni isu ga mitsu arimas. Hea ni, hea ni, isu ga, isu ga, mitsu, mitsu, arimas, arimas. How many tables are in the room? Hea ni, table ga, ikutsu, arimas ka? Hea ni, table, wa, ikutsu, arimas ka? There are three windows in the room. Um, Hea ni mado ga mitsu desu. Yeah. Hea ni mado ga 
三つです。三つ。あります。あります。That works as well. I wonder if you could say it. Hey, look at that. 121 days in a row of Duolingo streams. Good stuff, guys.、Uh, let's get a translation here. Hey, uh, ni mado ga mitsu des. There are three windows in the room. Okay, so it still works. Good stuff, ladies and gents. Let's get a time practice going. Um, Kiki? It's Kaki. We're gonna skip that because we got it wrong. Kiki is this one. Kiki. 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 Kaki. Mimas is. Mimas?、Uh, Kaki. Kaki. Kiki. Kiki. Zo. Zo.、Uh, Shogakse. Shogaku. Oh, Shogaku. Right, right, right. 映画館。映画館。も。も。あ、聞き。き。かき。かき。ろ。ろ。見ます。見ます。ベッド。あ、I think it's just ベッド。ベッド。Yep。I'm busy on the weekends。あ。週末。は。忙しいです。あ。I think。I think I was right。they don't tell you though。Uh, time is a、uh, jikan. I will write a letter to my friend. Tomodachi to. Mmm. No. Tomodachi ni. Tegami o kakimas. I think it's kakimas. Tomodachi ni. Uh oh. Tomodachi ni. Tegami. Ah. Where's Tegami? Tegami. Kakimas. Ah. Well, I think we had it right, even if we didn't write it in time. That's the problem, is you have to find all the characters after you figure it out. Well, good stuff, guys. We're sitting at number 10 right now. And we're right at the beginning of the week. Six days, 22 hours left. Unfortunately, we should have had another day to add to our、uh, you know, like, potential for getting into the next bracket. But、um, since I went live at six, then、uh, the bracket had already closed. So we like, basically only did six out of the seven. Days because we did it later in the day. Like, I guess for some reason it doesn't end at midnight. It ends at like, you know, 4 p.m. or something. It's really weird. It must be based in some other time zone. But 121 days in a row of Duolingo is nothing to sneeze at, guys. Now let's get it going. Let's get a raid message in that chat. We're going to be raiding at the end of the show here. Thank you for watching the show, guys. Tanoshi d e s t a And we are going to. Close it out with a raid as always. So make sure you copy down that raid message. It says, Meatball Marauders are here to party. And、uh, get ready to paste that into the chat that we join. If you're on a device that cannot copy or paste, then it also works to just write a message of your choosing to show that you're coming in with the raid. Don't forget the, the point here is to show that we're all coming in with the raid together. So、uh, we want to show that person that we're all joining with the raid. Whether or not you copy down the message, just write your own message if you can't. Either one works. Now,、uh, you got a couple minutes to get that ready though, because let's take the show out here. If you don't know the channel, it's called The Voice of Nick. I play video games live three times a day and seven days a week. It's all story focused games on here, but this one was our story of learning Japanese. We've been doing these for the past 121 days in a row. Secret fourth daily streams in addition to the three video game streams where I brush up on my Japanese, and you guys are able to learn along with me. Thank you for watching. Once again, Tanoshi d e s t a Now, guys, if you want to see which games are being played, you can type exclamation mark games in the chat. You'll get a full list of all seven concurring gameplay series going. And if you like what you saw today, don't forget to hit that follow button. Up top, you see a follower goal of nine. We're currently at six, so we're getting there, guys. The 28th entry in the Twitch playbook is out right now. That one is called Make Your Streams More Watchable, and that's going to help you to increase visibility and understandability on your streams for people, no matter what device they're watching on, even if it's on the smallest phone. Now, if you don't know the Twitch Playbook, it is a free podcast I created to help all of you guys in this community either create your own Twitch channels from scratch or improve on an existing channel if you already have one. Every episode is 10 minutes or less, so it's very bite sized, and it's been coming out for the last 28 weeks in a row, so there's plenty of it. You can find it on iTunes, on Spotify, on all the major podcast platforms by searching the Twitch Playbook, or you can type exclamation mark playbook into the chat, you'll get a link directly to it. 
If you like the channel, you want to support the stuff that I do, then consider subscribing. Subscribers get a whole bunch of stuff on here, including the voice of Nick Emote, legendary status in the chat and Discord, 200 meatballs, higher chance to win in the heist minigames, and ad-free streams. Another great way to support the stream is to cheer or donate. Cheers and donators both get custom voice of Nick voices as their shoutouts. On the donation leaderboards this week, we have nobody. They just reset uh, for some reason in the middle of the day. On the cheer leaderboards, we have in third place, Gaming Hour with 375 cheer. There's a purple level cheer. Thank you to Gaming Hour. Second place is Soong Yen with 600 cheer. There's a purple level cheer as well. Thank you to Soong Yen. First place is the Goonie with 1,000 cheer. There's a teal level cheer. Thank you to the Goonie. Thank you to everybody who supports these streams. It is highly appreciated. You are directly helping these shows to get better every single day. I improve at least one thing about this family of channels here, whether it is tweaking the Twitch streams you see in front of you, whether it is creating and posting content that goes on the social channels, whether it's updating and adding things to the Wiki or Discord, whether it's writing, recording, posting all the Twitch playbook entries, all that stuff, guys, is in large part thanks to all of you for supporting these streams by cheering donating, subscribing, gifting subs, or gifting games. Thank you so much to everybody who does it. It is very highly appreciated. Big shout out to all of our mods and admins as well who make this community amazing. Now let's see if we can find a channel to raid. The way we do raids on this channel is a little different than uh, many might be used to. We always raid someone here who's playing a previous game in our playthrough series, so as not to see any info about games that we're currently playing or any games that we plan on playing in the future. So let's see if we can join on this. Uh, oh, wait, who is this one? Are they playing? No, they're not. Okay, let's join this one instead then. Who is currently doing dee 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 dee? Yes. We have a Shroomy stream. Shroomy is currently playing Super Mario Maker 2, so let's jump into there, ladies and gents. Don't forget to show your love by posting that raid message in the chat. And of course, if you can't uh, copy and paste on your device, then writing in your own raid message works as well. It's very much appreciated when you do that, guys, whichever one you do, because it does show you're coming in with a raid. The objective here is to show that we're all coming in together and show that love to Shroomy. So I will see you all next time. Thank you for watching the show. We have one more video game stream coming up later today. But until then, guys, mata And uh, once again, for your Duolingo studies, benkyo gambate kudasai.